Hello and welcome to Stampin' by Hannah. Today I have this um, watercolour technique card for you using the Butterfly Basics stamp set. Um, this stamp set is available in clear mount, which is what I've got, wood mount and photopolymer and is available currently bundled with the most beautiful collection of butterflies framelits which i haven't got to hand but i will have the pictures of on the um in the blog post the link is in the down bar below i've also got a piece of early espresso cardstock which is a4 cut in half and a piece of uh, watercolor stamp up watercolor paper and three ink pads rich razzleberry early espresso and sahara sand so, first of all, I'm going to fold my uh, piece of early espresso in half to form my card base. And I've got my piece of watercolour paper. I'm going to take my Sahara Sand ink pad and I have the fern um, mounted onto my stamp block. I'm going to stamp it off once and then stamp it three times onto uh, my watercolour paper. Then, this is the watercolour bit. I've got the flower um, stamp mounted up and rich razzleberry ink. And I'm going to ink up my stamp really, really well. Get lots and lots of ink on there. And I have a water spritzer and I am going to spritz water across the stamp um, and get lots and lots of, it, of water on that on the stamp and get that ink really moving you can you see how how blurry that stamp has now become <sighs> how wet my grid paper is over here and then I'm going to stamp that onto my watercolor paper like that the beauty of this technique is that every time you do it the effect you get is totally different i'm just going to use my trusty microfiber cloth to mop up that splotch in the corner i've then got early espresso ink and i'm going to put the tiny weeny little circle stamp and i'm going to to just stamp a few times around the flower image with that and I've got the happy birthday sentiment and I'm just going to line this up along the bottom and stamp it down isn't that the most simple and easy watercolor technique you have ever seen <laughs> I'm gonna leave that to dry and then mount it up um, onto that piece of early espresso and you can already see how these two cards are totally different but using exactly the same watercolour technique so a really quick video for you today but thanks for watching all the links to all the products as usual are in the coordinating blog post links are down bar below and go over and like my facebook page thanks for watching bye for now